what do you think are, are, are a couple of the main reasons why this is definitely sort of not uh, a kind of a, a hoax or you well, may in a I, studio? May I first of all recommend a website to you, which is badastronomy.com. Mm. And this is uh, run by a very um, educated American called Phil Platt. Mm. And uh, he lists a lot of the different things that people believe about space, the universe, space flight, etc., which are simply rubbish. Yeah. Um, you know, you can see the Great Wall of China from the moon, can't you? Of course you can't, it's rubbish. <laughs> but people just recycle these myths because they can, you know. And yeah. uh, with the information boom that there's been in the last, say, 20, 30 years, mm. such things get passed around much more frequently much more readily and mm. uh, they're, they're seen more often so if you invent a myth then uh, a million people can see it within seconds yeah and uh, this is what's happening i think such things are being broadcast i mean there are lots of reasons why people think that uh, this moon landing was uh, a hoax but uh, if you if you look at it really i don't think they know a lot about photography and science and they just get it wrong. Yeah. Uh, oh, the there are no stars in the sky in the moon landing photos. They must be in a studio. Hmm. No, th those photos are taken with a Hasselblad camera at about a thousandth of a second exposure. And you, you won't get stars. They're not bright enough to show. If hmm. you just point a camera at the sky and go, clip, you won't get any stars. They're hmm. not bright enough. If you do a 10-minute exposure, you get thousands of stars. Yeah, yeah. And, uh, oh, the shadows are so black on the moon, it must be a studio floodlight. No, it's because the moon hasn't got an atmosphere. And in a vacuum, shadows look very black indeed. Mm. On Earth, shadows look sort of slightly grey because there's air intervening. And yeah, know. I see. So, so moon, there's a lot of science there that people just don't bring in. You know, they don't bring uh, that into the argument. Yeah, they don't really know the. Uh, I mean, uh, another thing too. Um, there were six moon missions that successfully landed. One of them, Apollo 13, as we know, didn't and had to come back. And, I mean, you can fool me once, but you're going to fool me six times. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> and, um, you know, thousands and thousands and thousands of people worked on the American space effort and on the Apollo moon landing program. Yeah. Not one of them has ever been to a tabloid newspaper and said, give me a million dollars and I'll tell you all about how they faked it. Yeah. I think somebody would have, don't you? Yeah. Yeah.